and we got the coldest water bottle in the building. If you want to get the coldest water bottle, let me hear you say, water break. That's what be like. <laughs> When we was watching that, well, you didn't want to watch it. She wanted to watch, listen to music. Hey, my babies! Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Ryan Jane. I'm back with another video. I hope all is well with you all, my babies. Today is Saturday. All is well with me. I hope we all are continuing to stay about happiness, peace, and love. I hope we all are continuing to stay determined, motivated, and focused. I hope we all are continuing to walk in the alignment of stars that Allah has with. And today's video, my babies, I'm doing a Spanish food mukbang. Back up! <laughs> So I'm about to show you the food. I just made the plates. I got a, I bought a large rotisserie chicken, white rice, beans, and salad. Oh my god, I made wookie slip. Let me show y'all my plate. You already know we about to get it in. Ah, yes, yes. I got el pollo arroz y arroz y arroz y. That's not gondolas. <laughs> this is um pinto beans. I don't know how to say it, but I got I, I, um, I got el pollo arroz y y, y pinto beans y salad. Mm, yes, we gotta get it. It's good. I tried the so. Y'all know I've been struggling for how long to get some damn Spanish food for years. So I finally was like, you know what? I went on Google. I searched up some places. Yeah, because I'm not even, um, I'm going to change it for <coughs> I went on Google and I searched up some places. So I've seen so many different places yesterday. And nobody delivered to where I live. Because they was like, oh, you're too far. So I was like, you know what? We'll get tomorrow. We're going to get my fucking food. And I said no. So, so. We just came back from getting the food. As you can see, I'm about to get, say praise and get it in. I'm hungry, I didn't eat nothing. I woke up this morning, cleaned my bathroom, <sighs> took a shower, and I was like, let's go. Okay, let me say my prayer. Thank you so much, Allah, for providing this food for me, distributing this food, giving me the money to buy this food, for blessing me and my family with this food, giving me, you know, and the body's good to see for the skills of cook this food, giving me, for blessing me and my family with this food, for blessing and nurture our bodies and soul. Allah, thank you so much, Allah, for this over experience. Allah, inshallah, I mean, woo, let's get it in. <coughs> so, I already put my hot sauce on it. Oh my god, this is what I needed. This is what I mm. need to And I am talking about one. They put um this salad is lettuce, peppers, onions, and tomatoes. So good. Oh my god. Only thing is when I used to get it when I when I used to get it back by my old house. I used to uh mm, let's get into that chicken. I used to get it with, um, I used to come in some little containers, some green sauce. Mmm. And, um, I used to pour the whole thing over my food. Now, I don't know. She didn't ask me if I wanted the sauce, and I didn't see it. She just asked me if I wanted, um, for the salad. She was like, did you want ranch, um, French dressing or Italian, some shit? And I was like, no. No sauce. No, none of that. I want that green. I don't know what it is. I gotta ask my friend. Cause my friend knows he's Mexican. The one I was talking shit about in the last mukbang. <laughs> yeah, but he knows about it, so I'm gonna ask him. Mm. In the oven. No. Oh. This is a whole chicken. And they put whatever seasonings they put, put it in the oven and cook it. Rotisserie chicken is actually easy to cook. I just go, instead of, you know, I normally get chicken cutlets. No, this time I will get a whole chicken. Like a turkey, you know how turkeys be looking? Big old turkey. They have the chicken too. Um, basically, you season it in a pan. No, this rice is good. I could cook rotisserie um rotisserie with chicken if I want, but I just don't got time for that. I need I need to stop being lazy. You get some pan, season it up. You want it juicy, and you know you want that you want that. Yeah. So what you gotta do is. You want to put a little bit of um, chicken broth in the pan too, because you don't want no dry chicken. Oh god! This piece is burnt. I 
It's okay. I don't mind a little bit of that. I don't mind. It's still good. I like pizza and dirt chicken. So where I went to get this food, I went to Coney Island. Um, it's crazy because Yeah, I know I'm from Coney Island. Yes. And I don't go out there. But I seen that the restaurant was right there on Mermaid Avenue. And I'm like, what the hell? Where have I been all my life that I never went and ate no food from there? Well, at least I know, you know, when I want some Spanish food, I can fill up to the hood <coughs> and get some food, some comida. But also, when I was looking on Google, I see that they had um they got some more they got some more restaurants over by Flatbush Avenue. Yeah, I know I'm always by Flatbush Avenue. Mm. Nope. Nope. That baby don't know nothing about that. So, if I don't want to go to Coney Island, I can always go to. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry, y'all. I thought it. I can always go to like Flappish area. The Flappish area. Because I see they got some Spanish food that way too. Bottom line is, I'm going to be going any, anywhere, okay? To get my food. What about me? They just so basic. They don't got shit over here, y'all. Yeah, I mean, literally, you know. Y'all see the same things that I eat, and it's like, if I didn't know how to, like, for people that don't know how to cook, I feel sorry for them because they eating the same fucking food their whole life. That's so boring. You need different food in your life. You can't just eat Popeyes, sushi, McDonald's, Chinese pizza. Like no, jelly food. Like no. Yeah, because you don't like my rice. Wookie hates my rice. When I cook rice, she she never eats it. She used to. When she was a baby, and when she was younger, she used to eat my food. She just really loves my meat. I know how to cook some good meat, some good chicken and stuff. But now, I don't know, I guess she's just tired of my rice. <laughs> All right, don't be telling everybody you don't like this and this and this. Okay. Okay, don't talk about your mother like that. Okay, mommy. <coughs> your mother takes care of you. So you need to respect your mother and tell your mother, mommy. That's okay, mommy. I don't want that. That's all. But she eat everybody else's rice. Not everybody else. She loves Chinese rice and Spanish rice. <coughs> I don't blame her because I love it too. As you can see, I'm tearing that shit up. You better eat that chicken. Okay. Oh, I'm trying to. Well, that's how chicken is. So I've been wanting to talk about something, but I don't think I'm going to talk about it. I don't think I'm going to talk about it. Um, I don't know. I just don't want to talk about it right now, you know? Also, we went to the candy store. Oh, no. And we got some candy. So we might do a candy mukbang after this. Um, so stay tuned for that if you want to see what candy we got. After this, we're going to let our food digest and we're going to get into that. Um, so that should be good, you know. Mmm. 
I'm almost done already. You know, I was fucking hungry. In other news, they're um they build so many so many new buildings in Coney Island. That's crazy. They look so different than when I was growing up there, you know? They look so different. They got so many fancy buildings now. So many white people is moving in there. A lot of gent gentr gentrification going on. But that's what happens when, you know, these white people with all this money want to take over a certain area, move them. They invest their money, build buildings and shit. Their people start moving in. And next thing you know, the black people start moving out because they can't afford it. So, you know, it's really sad. I'm going to be full as ever after that. What else is going on? Um... Not much, you know. You know me. I'm just blessed. Okay, that's it. What? You what? You what? No. I don't want to eat. Oh, you're not even eating. You ain't that hungry because you ate that pizza, right? Huh? You ate that pizza this morning. I know I got annoying ass fucking neighbors who don't do shit but bang on fucking walls. Oh my god. I don't think that'll fucking change until I get the fuck out of here. You know? Also. Everybody's really freaking out about, um, a potential World War Three? I'm not freaking out. I hate politics. I really do. Especially the climate that it's in these days. It's disgusting. It's so foggy out here in New York today. I thought they just said it was going to rain. I mean, it's raining, but you know, like, really, really, like, misty-like. And then it's just, like, so foggy. Like, you can't even see down the street or nothing. I slept so good last night. I wasn't trying to go to sleep as early as I did, but when I woke up, I was like, wow, I went to sleep, you know? They need to put just a little bit more seasoning on the chicken now. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. I should have got some plantain I was but <coughs> Yeah, no, yeah, no, I just ate plantain I was um 
Yes, it actually still got some leftovers in the fridge. Can I borrow your giraffe for a moment? Jenny, I think Miss Bingley got something for Jenny. Anyway, and then we getting off the bus. There was some guy in front of us getting off the bus too. And you know, people are so rude. Um, he see me getting off the bus with my kid. We were on the bus together. You know, I mean, we weren't together, but we, you know, we were on the bus together. So he sees that I'm right behind you getting off the bus. You can't even do what a young man is supposed to do uh, and hold a fucking door behind yourself. You know what I mean? When you see a mother getting off the bus with her kid. No, he left the fucking door almost slam in my face. Like, luckily I got a strong arm and I caught that shit like, the fuck? Oh, you know. Hold up. I done tore that shit up, okay? That's right. So, yeah, y'all, yeah, I don't want to talk to y'all. I don't want to talk y'all heads off. So, I'm about to finish my rice and beans. I done sucked up all the salad. <laughs> I finished my rice and beans. I done ate up all my chicken and salad. And yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy that I finally got my Spanish room. And I know y'all are happy for me too. Because, I, you know, at least I can stop complaining about that shit now. <laughs> okay, we done hit a milestone today. Raya J finally got some damn Spanish food in her stomach. Okay. How are you doing? All right, y'all. Thank you all for watching. I love you all so much. And I'll see you all in my next video. Peace and love. Bye. Bye.